Hey everybody, the following is an excerpt from a Rotto Roundup video, and if you'd like to see the rest of the Roundup that this came from, you can hit that I up in the top right corner screen or follow the show notes, or if you'd like to know more about the game, there's a link for it down in the show notes as well. Okay, let's get to it. Folks, it is time for my game of the month in a very wonderful month with a lot of really great experiences, nothing surpassed my farm shop. From designer Rudiger Dorn, and I say always bet on Dorn, you know, Mr. Goa, Mr. Istanbul, uh, Mr. Uh, oh, uh, Karuba, I think was that? Uh, yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, I mean, he's, uh, he's done so many brilliant designs over the years, and they're always such simple systems at their heart and yet they just blossom and do so much and so when i heard a new rudiger dorn game was coming i was excited but then i was like oh wait this is a family level game because it, it's it's all about you know running uh your farm and harvesting your goods to sell in your own little farm shop and it's 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 lovely and charming but really simple and cartoony it looks like a very family friendly kitty style game do not be fooled folks there is so much going on in this game. There's no other way to call this other than a Machi Koro killer. Machi Koro famously came out a few years ago, and it really um, popularized this idea of, hey, everybody's got a bunch of cards in front of them with numbers. you know, um, And every round, somebody's going to roll a die, and everybody gets to activate the matching card of that number. And you're trying to build a tableau of cards so that they can combo with each other, and then hopefully the die will let you activate the stuff you want. So, Machi Koro was a sensation. And it went on to spawn um, other games that took the core ideas of Machi Koro but really elevated them, like Space Base and you know, Valeria Card Kingdoms and a few others besides. And those were all great. Um, but My Farm Ecl Sharp eclipses all of them. It's the Machi Koro Killer. It's the Machi Koro Killer Killer. Uh, it is because it does so much more. On your turn, you're going to roll three dice. Um, one of those dice you are going to use to get a new card and add to your farm. And you uh, have to do this. And sometimes you don't want to. I've got the perfect farm, but I've I got to take one of these dice. The other two dice will then combine to let you and everybody else activate um, you know, a t one of the tiles on their boards. There is so much that goes into thinking, I just it's three simple dice. I'm, if, I, if I take this 3, that 5 and that 6 means it's an 11, which means I'm going to activate that, and you're going to activate that, and you're going to activate that. But if I take the 5, then the 6 and the 3 means everybody's going to activate their 9s, and I'll get the number 5 card. Um, and if I take the 6, you get the idea. It's super simple. And yet, you can... I mean, Jen, she got really lost. There, She had some very big analysis paralysis turns because there's so much you can plan out. You can see what all the cards you could eventually get are. You've got so many different combos that you can create on your board to set stuff up to pay off later. And you have to be so omnipresently careful about, oh man, this is what I want to do. I desperately want to get the card in slot number five. But that means everybody's nine. Your number nine card is your best card by far. That'll give you six points if I let you do that. I can't let you do that, but I so desperately need this five card. The tension and the angst you feel just trying to decide how to deploy these three little dice is so you know gut-wrenching in the best way. You're just like, oh, I, want to, I, I can't do it all. And I, I just love it from start to finish. And um, it is such a blast. And now, interestingly... I think this could still work as a gateway, or certainly a gateway plus game, because a lot of the core elements here are so simple. And yet, there's so much depth and richness. Rudiger Dorn once again demonstrates to the world why he is one of the premier designers, one of the designer superstars out there. And you should always pay attention to what he's got coming out, even if you look at the box cover and you think, well, that just looks like it's, you know, for kids. My Farm Shop offers so much more. It is deep and rich for days. It's got tons of replayability, tons of variability, and I absolutely love it. My best game of the month. And I think it was my wife's second best. She, uh, I, There's one she liked more, uh, but oh my gosh, My Farm Shop is not going anywhere. It's too early to say. We're only halfway through the year it might make it into my top 10 of the year, quite frankly. And you wouldn't expect it. Do not judge a book by its cover. Uh, definitely, when you get a chance, look a little bit deeper. Look beyond the cover of My Farm Shop.